Good morning world. In the coming weeks, I'll be taking some time to update some of the videos that I did at the very beginning where the quality was pretty awful. And so I wanted to update them and, you know, improve the quality and stuff like that. And um, the video, the series I'm working on right now was based on the book Breaking Through Infinity. I will post the link somewhere so that you can access it if you'd like. Uh, the, so today we're talking about the five, five requirements for making change. First of which is that you have to decide that you want something to change. You have to decide that you want a change. Make that decision and then, you know, kind of, you know, commit to the decision. And once you have made the decision, you need to identify possible targets for change. Because what happens is that sometimes a person may decide, yeah, something needs to change, but because you have not identified a particular area, you have to identify a particular area in your life, a particular area in your environment, something that the, a section where you want the change. You can't just say, yeah, my whole life needs to change. You need to start with specific areas of your life that how you want to change them. And then you need to start prioritizing your targets because when you do, when, especially because um, change in life is so personal, when you're looking at making a change, sometimes you'll have many different things that you'd like to improve or that you'd like to change, but you need to deal, work on each one at a, one at a time or however it's going to be. But so in order to decide, hey, which ones am I going to start with first, it's important to take time and prioritize your targets. Which one do you want first? Which one do you need most? And then that way you can go to the next one, which is selecting a starting point. Once you have uh, prioritized your targets, it should make, a, make it a lot easier to determine which area, which target that you want to make a change in. And of course, once you have done that, the next step is going to be to set a goal. It's, more, it's not enough to, have the, to make the decision and decide where you want the change. You need to start setting goals and where, because the goal is how you start actualizing, where you start making that desire for change materialize. The goal is where you start going from, hey, I wish, I hope, I would like, into, hey, I am getting this. And we'll talk about that in the coming days. So quick recap. One, you have to decide that you want a change and then you, you have to identify the targets, areas in your life that you would like to change. Then you have to take the time and prioritize your target, rank your targets, determine which one you want or need most. And then you have to select your starting points based on the priorities that you have identified. And finally, you need to start setting specific goals. And we'll be talking about that next. And that is all we have for today. Good morning world. Have an awesome day.